this? Almost out. Finally. I'm so sick of shit. At least you don't have to listen to that crap no more. Shit. Wait. What did you do? You shot up his generator, killed his radio uplink, didn't you? Goddamn right I did. Now none of us have to listen to that shit. Fucking radio free Oregon bullshit. Now it's Copeland free Oregon. What's up? Stupid asshole. What do you think? He's gonna let that fly? Dumb shit. You're all that. Don't mind if I do. What? generator, but it's been shot to hell. Okay, the 
That should do it. There we go. Drop it! If you had bullets, I wouldn't be breathing now, would I? Please, mister. I don't shoot women if I have a choice. Do I have a choice? I ain't got nothing. I got nowhere to go! Jesus Christ. All right, let's see if they got an underground bunker around here. What's this? A map? Notes? Yeah, okay. What do we got here? How to craft... Okay, yeah. Okay. Deke, you there? It's probably nothing. You sounded like bike engines. Riding somewhere on the mountain. I just finished clearing the radio tower for Copeland. I'm, I'm gonna climb the tower, see if I can see anything. <laughs> Finally. Hey, Deke, you okay? You don't sound like, like yourself. It's, uh, it's nothing. You know, I just let this drifter get the drop on me. Lucky for me, she was uh, out of ammo. You let her go, didn't you? Okay. Yeah, fuck. Yes, yes, I let her go. One of these days, Deke. That code of yours is gonna get you killed. Yeah, well, something's gonna do it, right? Does it matter what? Deacon out. Jesus, what a climb. All right. Let's see what the hell Boozer's talking about. We're right. Someone's on the mountain. I see smoke from their campfire. Oh, son of a bitch. I knew I heard something. Where are they? I'm gonna head out there. No! God damn it, Boozer. Gotta get your arm healed up so we can ride the hell out of here. I'll take care of him. Ah, oh, shit. It's just... I'm going a little stir crazy here, Dick. Try to stay awake in case they head your way. Deacon out. Almost there. Yeah, come on, keep going. Almost there. Oh, shit's killing me. I got a use for you. Fuel can.
St. John to Copeland's camp. It's done. The radio tower's locked down. I've restored your radio bubbling. Copy that. You may not see the value in St. John, but Radio Free Oregon is the only thing keeping us from turning into savages. <laughs> no, no, the only thing keeping us from turning into savages is about nine square meals. Try going hungry for three days. There's no such thing as a starving patriot. Well, sir, I hope to God you're wrong about that. Cool it out. Radio Free Oregon. Jesus, what have I done? Booze man, you awake? I'm uh, heading to that camp you spotted north of the mountain. Uh, I heard gunshots. Uh, it might be an ambush camp. I'll find out when I get there. Deacon out. Man, you were right. They set up along the railroad tracks. Kill every one of these sons of bitches. That was kind of the plan. Deacon out.
That's the last of them. Stay the hell off O'Leary Mountain. Boozer, it's done. Squatter camp. They won't be doing any more killing on O'Leary Mountain. Good. Deke. I should have been there. To help, I mean, I... Shit. Just rest up, booze man. Rest up. We're riding north as soon as your arm heals. You got that? Yeah, yeah, I hear you. <laughs> Boozer out. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna ride up to the cemetery and see if I can find Leon's stash. Sorry. What was that? Rest up, loser. We're heading north as soon as you can ride. North? Yeah. Deke! Oh, god damn it. I'm sick and tired of drifters coming in my camp, killing folk like we were out in the shit. What's going on, Cope? man come in, drugged out of his mind, shot the place up, then he just took off. Nanny said his bike's got a red tank on it, and he was wearing some kind of motocross helmet, silver. Okay, if I go now, I might be able to catch up to him. I want him alive, Deke. Alive? Alive. You catch this man, then radio me. We'll fetch him and hang the bastard right from that limb. It's time we start showing these drifter sons of bitches that we have law and order in this camp. No offense meant to yourself. What's going on? A man come in, drugged out of his mind, shot the place up, then he just took off. Then he said his bike's got a red tank on it, and he was wearing some kind of motorcycle silver. <laughs> <laughs> If I go now, I might be able to catch up to him. I want him alive, Deke. Alive? Alive. You catch this man, then radio me. We'll fetch him and hang the bastard right
right from that lamp. It's time we start showing these drifter sons of bitches that we have law and order in this camp. No offense meant to yourself. None taken. I'll find them. God damn it, what you all shit yourself at once? Jesus Christ. No, no, you're gonna get yourself killed. Uh, you gotta wait till your whole brother. Uh, I'm over here anyway, so I'll take care of the mess, okay? Yeah, okay. Thanks, Steve. Getting kinda cool out of here. Who's man now? You know I wouldn't ride north without you. Yeah, yeah, I know. I just kind of out of it. Well, third degree burns will do that to you. Yeah. So take care, of Alvarez. You know, Deke. It means a lot to me. I'll take care of her, Boozer. Just get some rest. Deacon out. Goddamn freaks. What the hell are you doing in here? Huh? Or take them out while it's still light out. There'll be more of them, but they won't be as strong. Deke, you there? I got bored. Figured I'd see if I remembered how to make anything. Stop by when you can. I think you'll like it. Uh, yeah, I do need some deacon out. Come on, fellas. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Who remembers the skid rows of this great country? People living on the streets in boxes and tents because they couldn't afford the American dream. So those guys oh, will fall for this very country. Only to have the feds forget about them as soon as they were done with them. PTSD doesn't stand for post-traumatic stress disorder. It stands for put them soldiers down. Well, mm, we're all good. homeless now. Living in the woods we have our forebearers. Feds used to think we needed their welfare and handouts to survive. We should have been here. What here. we need now is a strong will, determination, and trust in each other. The Feds were never going to give us that. And you? You want our trust? You gotta earn it. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. That's great. That's great. Radio Free Organs on the air once again. Oh, Jesus, we might not. Just come on. Burn, 
Those nests should be less freaks on the mountain from now on. Hey, Deke, how'd it go? Were there, were there a lot of them? Yeah, but I wanted to clear them while it was still light out. You know how the sunlight bothers them. Yeah, that's, that's probably the way to do it. Right, anyway, well, thanks for thanks for doing that, Deke. <sighs> I guess I'm shut eye, Boozer. Deacon out. St. John, this is Copeland. I haven't seen Boozer in a few days. He used to do runs for me is all. I know you ride with him. I tried to radio him, can't seem to reach him. When you see him, you tell him to swing by and say hello to Copeland. Much appreciated. So close to O'Leary Mountain. Don't ask me how. Infestation zone. Sure smells like it. <clears throat> gotta burn it down. I gotta clear them out. <clears throat> 